tonight we will be posting the link so you could actually, if you want to join in, join in. in the conversation, the discussion. Of course, I'm sure if you've been watching the news, you'll be aware that uh, with regards to the appeal for Vibes Cartel, it's so far so good. It's looking very good for him. Um, so, yeah, we definitely want to discuss and see your thoughts in regards to what will be the next move. What's going to happen in terms of, is he going to walk away free? What do you think, Mr. X? Well, I I don't think it, it, it will be that easy for him to walk, walk away free because... Um, there is a there is there is a there is a, a long process when it, when it comes to 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 them 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 kind of you know the, the the situation is 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 in you know mm -hmm. it's a long process so it will be not easy and plus um um what that happened hmm. you know the, the the forgery and everything so so um um the system they, they don't want to they don't want to look bad you know so they try they will try to drag it in a way so they won't right. look bad you know right. so if they just do it just like that they will say oh that the system is corrupt and this and that so they don't want to make people see that they corrupt so they want to they want to drag it you know well i mean so far i mean the man has spent 12 years already behind that's, bars. A, long, that's a long that's a long time eh? that's a very long time you know and his health it's is about um 13 12 years. to 14 years i think yeah, and as well, yeah. his health is, his health is also failing. His health is failing, yeah. so that's part of the reason that they're hoping, you know, to see him walk free. I feel I feel he's gonna walk. He's gonna he's gonna walk free because I mean it's the process I've been going through, and now he's going through the UK courts and stuff, and then I mean it's gonna. Well, it's down to. The Jamaican judicial system, how or whatever they decide moving forward, because whilst yes, they could drag their feet through the process. In fact, they could even reject that decision and just decide to keep the man behind bars. Because mm. you know, anything would happen at this stage. But yeah, it, man, boils, so, well, <laughs> it begs the question: the man must have some real good lawyers, boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, with all those number one hits being bars, you, you you must have good lawyers, eh? With all those number one, well, no, not necessary because you have a lot of artists that have had number one hits and they don't really the financial aspect. They have not necessarily been in the best position in terms of recouping all the what's due to them as an artist. We know that a lot of the times. Um, artists get the shorter end of the stick in terms of with the label and the management, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And pretty much when you find yourself behind bars, your label basically this on you be behind you. Yeah, they're not going to be investing in, in in you. But you know, when last have we heard a new song from Vibes Cartel? Um, when... this this year he just released a, a, a track this year. Okay. Um. Yeah. Like yeah. You just you always, you always, you always dropping tracks. You know. You always dropping, doing collabs. Yeah. You know. The Every guy in prison be... and and he's, and he's he's making money. And not relevant. He's still relevant. That's the thing. Yeah. You know. Yeah. That, like what you say, Leo. He's relevant. He's still very, very relevant. And in fact, pick up yourself, I, Desi J. Pick up yourself. I could predict if he comes out of jail. Can you imagine other prisoner? Can you imagine? in terms of the reception he's going to get and in fact the demand to see this guy live can you imagine yeah because that? people been people have been waiting eh? but let's, let's just, look at it's just like, it's just like just, yeah that's what i was about to say just like buju you know so you think you think you think he, he will he will break um buju buju's record oh yeah like when when yeah when when buju came from prison and when he did the show they said that was history so uh, what's about five cartel when they come out from prison? Okay. People know Buju mm. basically conscious music and, and when Buju was locked up, the difference is Buju was locked up in the States. So it's different. He couldn't have released music like 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 Cartel was releasing throughout all these years. Cartel was actually having number ones, dominating the chats, dominating the scene from behind bars. 
You understand? Yeah, yeah. And yeah, you could yeah, imagine yeah. the promoters, bro. If you think this guy was wealthy, I think if he comes out now, he'll be mega rich. Mega rich. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah, mega yeah, rich. yeah. And Cattle, mm -hmm. Cattle will make millions, I tell you, millions. Millions. Well, well, he's yeah. making that already, but he's going to make, he's going he's gonna to tri triple that when he starts performing live. Triple you know? it. Because the, all the money they I, make when I, they, they perform I, live I, is there. I don't, I don't know if some countries will prevent them from performing, you know. No, but yeah, but I, I think some, I think people will come, I think people will come down to Jamaica and uh, to go down to Jamaica and see him instead, you know, because I mean, if you can't go on, if you can't travel to, to see him or you can book other shows, you must have the shows back in this country, you know, so. Let me tell you. It's just like, just like Buju, before his first show, everybody fly down to, to Jamaica to see the show. You know, so. Um, I think if you look at so, the dancehall trend, how the music has evolved, I think if he's to come back on the scene, that is what dancehall really needs at the moment. Because mm -hmm. the dancehall music has somewhat gotten a bit watered down. I'm not talking about in terms of the lyrical content. I mean, like, from a sonic point of view, listening. You know, traditional dancehall and what it, what it represents. The music has evolved so much. And it's just like, with this man um, being out there performing, you know, the amount of youths that look up to that man, the amount of Vibes Cartel wannabes, you know? That's gonna inject a certain energy in the dancehall space that is currently not there. You know what I mean? Because if you look at the guys like, well, popcorn to some degree. I mean, popcorn has still been doing his thing, but the impact popcorn has ha had back in the day in terms of with, with, with um vibes cartel. And can you also imagine the amount of artists? Hip hop artists as well. That'll be reaching out to this guy to do collaboration. You can just can you just imagine the amount of bro? They have to free this man. But then again, thinking about it, we have to look at both sides of the cake, both sides of the angle. If he gets free, is uh, if he because of the the failure of the judicial system, um, his freedom. What does that mean for the for the alleged? Well, the victim and the family of uh, of the victim. You have to look at both sides of the coin. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's the other thing too, yeah. Yeah, but to my understanding... Lisa family. Yeah, but to my understanding, yeah. there's not enough evidence to, to, to keep him in. They, they, I mean, that's what that's the whole thing about the case, you know? It's so. a mixture of not enough evidence as well as there was a juror there was some issue with a juror, I think, uh, some bribery or something. That that that. And also, old... and also the, the 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 police officer who went with the phone. I think the phone that was the main key, you know. And the police went to his home with the phone and come back with it. That but was the problem. All, we all know in the Caribbean. We all know how yeah. things, things operate. I mean. <laughs> what I don't understand, why why England had to involve in that some? Well, it's not that England involved. So you have to look at they call it what they call it um, the Privy Council. So that's like the, the that's like where they have the High Court. Well, if you look at it on a, on a world scale, so in other words, if you believe that there's been injustice served to you, you could take it. Yeah. You could present your case there to that 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 court, and they will review okay, it okay. and determine well whether that decision or whether the trial was fair so that's what has really happened if if you try to do a, an appeal in your well you know in your country and uh, then you're not satisfied i guess yeah. you could check it to take it to that so, level so that, that 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 is why so that is why the the, the 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 case went back to to jamaica for a retrial to be considered well they be could considered either, that way, yeah right <laughs> they could either agree that you know justice was served, yeah, yeah. Let, them go, let them go, let the man go, let him be free, or they could go to a retrial. A retrial, what does that mean? That's a lot of cost on the on the on the on the country. You understand? So a retrial yeah, is not yeah, a simple yeah. fact as just going back to court, but there's a and, and a lot of the old they said a lot of the evidence, the old evidence they had be present before. That's how retrial, many and, and that's that's to, to, to do uh, to do to do. 
to to have an, another another retrial that that's that's a lot of money you know you have to pay the judges you have to pay the lawyer you have to pay oh my god that's a lot of money you know so yeah but freedom freedom cost that's yeah. the thing freedom freedom every cost right so if that's what you have to do to be free you gotta go you have to go for the process right and chances are according to according to what the privy council has said or decided this man should basically mm. be free in the eyes of the Lord. I have the, the law. He should basically be free. But it's down to Jamaica legal or the court system to determine what happens. So even if the Privy Council say, well, yes, that's our findings, you know, it's down to them. They could drag mm. that thing. They could say, well, yeah, okay, we're going to retrial. But they could drag that. You know how the, the system is. Sometimes they have people yeah, yeah. that and it's years before they... they, they, they yes, they, you know, they, that's why I tell you, it, it, will, it will be not easy. They will drag it, drag it. But at, at the end of the day, these guys are, are no longer considered as, as convicted murderers, you know. Do you think it was any, if it was any other, any other artist you could think of um, in the Caribbean, do you think um, we would be, we'd be having a discussion? Do you think it would be on that level that the man actually possibility of walking free was any other artist well uh i was saying the same thing i had a conversation with a friend of mine and we said the same thing you know if it was another artist or another local pass pass person on the street that would just finish sometimes that person would not, would not might even go to prison because there is no evidence you think money but because has of and, and, and uh, the, the position he is, you know. Yeah, but it, 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 I mean, if you look at it, there have been other, there have been hip hop, hip hop artists that has also been, um, you know, accused of murder and on trial and have beat the case. There have been, you know, different celebrities that have walked free, but in yeah, the crowd, um, OJ. So you know, um, 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 PDD is, PDD is, is an example. Oh, boy, uh, well, 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 boy, don't, I don't, don't even touch that because we have no evidence of anything, Alleg just a lot of speculation. Allegedly, a lot of, so, so, a lot of speculation. PDD so. and is almost the same, you know. No, it's not, it's it, different it is cases. Not murder. It's not murder, PDD is, um, it's sexual uh, harassment, sexual. sexual harassment, human trafficking, this sort of thing, sexual abuse. Yeah. Um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm two pack, two pack situation as well. Yeah, but that was that was that was count as in, in, there's no evidence for that because out of all the investigations, there's nothing and, for that. So and, and, and so people, you, you people have, have come out and and and, 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 yeah, and that, spoken, you know. About yeah, that. But, uh, once again, once again, something I oh, I always say: we in, we in a system where black people bring on bring down other black people because if you can destroy somebody, you destroy them. Why so, yeah, I'm not, black people are I'm, bringing them down. I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, it's just we, 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 we in a system right now. If you're looking at right now from the, the beginning of the year, it's only only us that destroy our own self, no matter what it is. Yes, if we do the crime, you have to pay for the crime, right? But that's a very that's the, a very general statement. I don't know if I agree with that, Leo. I understand, no, but I'm saying, saying, I, I just think I don't, think, do, it, I don't it, think in the case. Of what look at okay, look for example uh, who, are you, who are you speaking about the reference let's just let's just I, I, I'm, re I'm referencing if you go online if you go online right now and you check about pdd everybody are talking about him is our own people no no not really a lot of the blogs i've been watching a lot that's of, that's you, that's you see, people what, 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 okay go ahead go ahead with your point go that's ahead. Pe that's people that's people speculating from the news that they they, they have received from the other people but if you check there's that one, there's, I can't remember her name, but she, she used to be it's part of the label that, and stuff. Oh, 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 that, that, that okay. Yeah. So the bodyguard, uh, the, the, um, like a lot of people just, just, the, but, the, they bind into that, you know? So. No, but let's put, let's, let's, let's look at it that way. Let's look at it that way, okay? Is the people that are around you that will know your secrets, isn't it? Not yeah, really. Exactly. Okay. So if you have a business, Leo, and your business is, you know, maybe many African Americans, you know, that that is around you employed. And if today or tomorrow, okay, those people and yourselves, your relationship have fallen apart, and those people will come forward and say, well, yeah, I, I noticed that about Leo, this about Leo. 
it's not necessarily black on black. I wouldn't class it that. I, although I believe systematically there is there is a, a movement that tries to deface or discredit um, our prominent black figures, especially in the en entertainment and sports industry, once they reach a certain level, you know, um, don't like to mention names, but let's look at R. Kelly. Let's look yes. at Bill Crosby. You know, let's look at who else again? Tiger Woods. There's several celebrities that you could think of. But the point is that I don't think it's the black people that have the ability to cripple those people empire like that, my brother. I think black people, yes. But look, but look at look, but look at look at um in the states they, right now they have the um, the Rico case going on with the the black mayor crucifying all the rappers on the words. Bro, you bringing a you bringing a racial element in there? No, it's not, it's not. No, I'm not trying to bring a racial element. I'm just I'm just explaining that you know mostly right now as you as you seen and as you watching from a distance you seen like it's just the unity of what we had before is just not there anymore it's just it was there. that was no? there, that, unity, that unity was never there bro <laughs> that was never there to begin with you know okay so all right so is it a case of if with, with, with vibes cartel are you saying that it is a uh, uh, black people that, that has put him behind bars like i say if you do the crime you still the time right Wait, I want to ask you that equally, equally, okay. Black people put it behind his bar. But the, the Privy Council is predominantly white ethnicity that's that sit on that 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 um panel that decide that the man should be free. Yeah, I know, but that's a, well, that, I understand that. But for me, since I don't have much information about what's going on, I just started reading about it and stuff. I I cannot really say speculate on those. Oh, well, he did, he did the crime, or he didn't do the crime. So um, as I'm saying, in the previous comment, I was saying that when um, X said about PDD, and I said that majority of all the people are talking about him and against him is mostly our people. It would be because you know? the, the the man don't really have so many dealings with with other than his own. He's as long, as far back as I can remember, every girlfriend the man has had has been of our race. I don't like saying black, but of our race. Um, every artist, mainly the man has actually have. So that's the people that will come forward and 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 be able to say, well, yeah. And then you have to realize as well, there's a lot of bad blood there. There's a lot of um people that you know when you at a certain level, bro. Um, you will get enemies, bro. You will get enemies. You will get people that feel entitled. I'm not. I'm not defending PDD, but I'm just saying, you know, you become a target because look at that. For whatever reason, he signed the the, the, the first lawsuit. Look, there's a second and a third. So you know, you become a target when you have when you have money. So yeah, I could understand maybe yeah, it's our own trying and um trying and fight you down. But I think bigger than that, there's there is. There's a bigger force that we don't we don't know of or don't necessarily see that is behind discrediting our our superstars, our role models. Because the, the things that these people have been accused of is not is not activity that just started in the last no, that's that's, that's things that over 20 years. Exactly. 17 years. Exactly. So look at it that way. Why is it always when um they reach to the point in the career where they've they, they maybe the usefulness or the influence kind of diminish. You know, look at look at um, Bill Crosby. You know, the man was trying to lock some deal, some network deal, and all of a sudden they came out with those accusations. You think those you think those accusations are just surface out of nowhere, bro? Those people have publicists. Those people have uh, teams that do damage control. So when a scandal come out to nip that in the bud before that even hit the media. Those people are good friends with the owners of these networks and those stuff like that. So when you see all of a sudden it's reverse and all where you turn, all you're hearing is PDD this or that one, this or that one, that. Or, you know, when you start hearing that, you know there's a systematic machine in place 
Now the bloggers, obviously, the black, well, our race, I don't like saying black, I said like our race, <laughs> we, yeah. especially a lot of us are bloggers and content creators, okay? So they will run this stuff. And now as I'm getting and learning about that, that whole online marketing stuff, you know, if you follow a story that's trending, it means that when somebody type that, your thing will come up. So yeah, a lot true. of people are just repeating things that, okay, none of us don't know the facts unless it goes to trial or whatever. And I think Middle will do anything in his power to, to pay off if he can to avoid anything coming out, really. Look, his producer came out and say this and that. But that, that, but but now they say they're fighting that they're fighting that because it's the, they have a video and proof about it. So it's just I see a lot of people speculating and a lot. Of, it's just like I say, you know, it's a tough, it's a tough, a tough deb debate and stuff. And it's you know, like you know, you need more evidence to just start, you know, to to be on that panel too. We you know, say they're guilty of thing, but I I, I just. I don't buy into the idea that is. Hey, everybody have everybody has skeleton in the closet, eh? So you know, so if they start pulling the one by one, you know, it just skeleton. You know, I don't see no skeleton in in in, in closet. I close we have in our closet. Eh? <laughs> 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 but you know, it shows you if you're an artist and you have money, make sure you have a good legal legal team. Make sure you put money aside. Because somewhere, somehow, something will come up. Oh, yes. Will oh, come yes. up, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. yeah. Something yeah. will come up. And yeah. then, if you have money, maybe you could nip it in the butt if you don't have money. Then, you know, boy. But again, too, people don't really come after broke people. People don't sue broke people. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody comes to me because you're going to get the thing. You're going to get the thing. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know, I think. This guy should probably r have written a book by now. You know, I think um, he has a lot to tell about the life behind bars. I think that's more more than just his music. That's what that's that's the message I I would hope when he when he's free he comes out with that message of to discourage others from going in there because you know um, he's a very powerful voice. And you know he has a story and he has a message. I think that's deeper than music. You know, on the surfaces, I think it's deeper than music. But what do you think? Let us know, Desi. Uh, feel free to um weigh in and put your two cents, guys. Let us know what you think because. But I think I think I think if they canceling if they if they start canceling um like his music and stuff, there'll be a lot of like music I'll be because he 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 was one of the big bigger influence in the like in the 90s and it, the 90s to the 2000s with when it comes to music like b2k 112 all those big um oh, act, um, groups. yeah so you know so it's it's i don't think they will cancel dd music man. well look, look 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 they look at they cancel arcade music and then they decide oh well we're gonna bring it back and we're gonna we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna um to we're gonna um <laughs> well, I still play. I still play music, but they, they say we're gonna cancel him. Now they say they're taking the the money in the um in the sales. They donated it to the victims. You know, the victims. So I mean, yeah. Of R. Kelly. Yeah. So they cancel his music. They are blocking on Spotify and all them places. Just now get, they just they, get, they just get just get straight, straight, straight to the point. They, they 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 wanted to to buy his catalog, so he he doesn't want to. So that is why they have him in there. That is right. it. Right. And and, and I believe it. that too. I believe that too. I believe that too. Because especially when he was at the point where he was still making and generating money and in a position mm -hmm. to fight and beat that case. Nothing was happening. You know, nothing was happening. And then when he loses momentum, you know, and they want to just own his catalog. Because you have to realize most most celebrities. Is either they die before their time, or they get locked up. Yeah. You understand? Is one yeah. or the other. So, with him, I guess R. Kelly, boy, God forbid. I I really be hope and pray that you know 
that these stories are not true, but he's serving his time. You know, he's serving his time. Um, there are people around him as well that should have possibly been um, behind bars as well for in, 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 enabling him. You know, because yeah. like I said, this is not stuff that's been happening overnight. People were aware of those stories. Like, you know, even some of the family members of those victims were actually bringing um, you know, the people around him even after the stories of him being a predator and these things, bringing the all the on the basis of of um he maintained them and it was the same if you listen to the stories about allegedly the stories about Usher and you know and stuff like that you know I mean bro I can't imagine me ever I don't care which superstar whatever who you are I can't imagine bringing my kid and leaving my kid in the hands of some 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 um some music guru Exactly. Yo, know, the matter, the matter, the matter who you are, the matter who you are, you should never leave your kids with anybody. You should supervise your kids a hundred percent. You understand? And I blame some of the parents for for this this leaving the kids there because they trust. You don't trust anybody with your kids. You understand? The matter who, the matter who, you don't trust anybody. You have a nanny, you put a nanny come. Yeah. <laughs> Can we say that though? Some of the, the effect that those celebrities have on some of us, it's like you idealize those people. Like you 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 think that I they're don't, God. I, I don't care. I don't care. Uh, no, I'm, I'm no. not saying you, you know. I'm just saying a lot no, of people. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, yeah, the same, yeah, yeah, but at the same time, as parents, your 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 job is to protect that kid with at all times, at all with all force. I'll never bring my daughter someplace and say, okay, you, you that person, watch my daughter, I'm out, call me when you're done. No. Bro, you, 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 you go upstairs, I upstairs, you go downstairs, I go downstairs, you're in the basement, I there too. Yeah, but you know? in, in certain, in certain, um, in certain scenarios, that is not possible. So for example, if you, if you take your daughter to ballet classes or, or if your daughter has a recital, or some sort of examination in terms of to do with the arts, you're not allowed to be around for that time. If, for example, um, we got offer for my youth to do to to do modeling, and part of the thing is they want to be able to take him away from school at any time. There are certain times you have to put him in the care of whoever is responsible, his agent, and you have to rely on them because they're going to be taking him to some shoot somewhere. How many miles away? You can't necessarily be there. You sign those sort of contracts. So you can't say, well, boy, I signed that contract. Um, I have to be there with my child. It's, it's, like, it's like trusting. But we kind of, when we want something so bad, we overlook certain things, I believe. Yeah, that's true. That's true. I agree with that. But again, the, the once I know the location, I'll be there. Okay. All right, forget yeah. about forget about your kid. Let's say it was you now, Leo, that got the opportunity to work with PDD. I mean, I know you before those. Let's say before those accusations came out, or even you, Mister X. I know how to get a call. Boy, PDD just shot me there. Boy, I am just about to book. I'm, I'm on a flight there to go and check that man. You know, and, then, and, then, and then you start saying, then you start saying, bring, oh, then you start saying, oh, 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 then you start saying, bring your, bring your, bring your, bring Exactly. You don't going to think. You not going to think of boy. That's a, hmm, I wonder what PDD really want. That's a, you're gonna be thinking of that. You're gonna be thinking like boy. That's a, just to stop one to selfies and say yeah boy in PDD studio. Bam bam bam. You know just to show. <laughs> you know you'll get mileage out of that. So we kind of idealize those artists and think that they cannot do wrong. We think so highly of them, like this, like above human nature. You know. But in reality, the, the truth of the matter is, oh, there are people just like us and they're prone to make mistakes. So they're not exempt from that. But equally, they have to fit the consequences for the action. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, I, I like that part. I agree. Right? If, if, we, if any of us get a call to work with one of those mega stars, we'll, we'll just like, it's a place that you go and you, you, you learn. You understand? Okay. Because everybody looking for um, for somebody to mentor them, 
to get right. better at, at, at what they're doing. Right. But if you, you go, but since since you know, you go with the mentality of that you you're aware of the situation. You don't go with an open mind, just like okay, I'm all in. No, you go with the mentality that you want to you to learn, to adjust, to get better. And then you come back and you and you and you show whatever you have to show. Okay. But if you if, if <laughs> On the reversal side of it, big up yourself, Jamal. Big up yourself. You're free to join in. I have the link in, in the thing. Big up yourself. On the reverse of that, Leo, let's say you you we've heard those accusations. Yeah? Would you turn down an offer to work with somebody that you know or you suspect? No, I won't I won't turn down the offer. I think I like, say you go you go the, the, the mentality to, to uh -uh. what? Ex no, nah, I'm just saying, I'm not saying, yo, listen, <laughs> no, 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 listen, listen, my brother, listen, no matter what people do, you, you control your narrative, you know, bro, you, you, you don't want knowing what, like, yo, if you go and you feel like somebody, look at, um, um, that guy there, um, the guy that was always flexing his body, Terry, Terry, Cruz or Terry, yeah, Terry, yeah, you know, he got grew up on all them things and now he's picking out. You know what I'm saying? That is the industry, bro. That is the reality. Yeah. The, the now, now, the only thing you might hear read about Leo just beat somebody down. You know, you get... boy. But it's not just um, that. The, the, the stories will, boy. The drinks will be in spite, allegedly. All these kind of things. That's criminal activity, you know, bro. If it's you or me that do that, somebody comes to your studio and you offer them a drink. And they wake when they wake up. Right, I, I walk in my water. They, they walk, they're living there, walking on their side. You deserve to take a jail, <laughs> a, a, a prison thing. <laughs> yeah, of course, yes, of course, yes. But I mean, that's that's that's, that is the of, that's that is the type of stories. The artists complaining, the producers complaining, his exes complaining. Where there's smoke, there must be smoke, isn't it? So what 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 about you, Sam? If you get a chance to work with with PDD, and you know. Um, he's where he's where he's where about. Look at X. Look at X. <laughs> X. Yeah, man. We 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 go together in the studio, all three of us. <laughs> I bring you all with me. I go by myself. I don't care what you say. Because if I go by myself, nothing I could say. You could be like, ah. Uh -huh. I go. All three of us go. We go see for ourselves. I said, PDD. Um, Daman is my producer. Daman is my manager. That you know, no worry, man. I got manager producer for you. Well, boy, that is my two brothers there. You know, we have to go together. We have to see. <laughs> when they offer you a drink, I want you. Know, I want you to drink it. <laughs> nah. <laughs> but again, too, people of of authority, not just in the music industry, you know, it's everywhere, everywhere, world, everywhere. Yeah, in a position of authority, they tend to exploit those that they consider to be vulnerable or below them and yeah it's a fact that it's not just it's it's not just in in the entertainment thing um some of you know people on the high rankings in terms of officials that are guilty of such things uh, but look but look 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 recently in ottawa in canada one of the the principal from the the, the school board got um fired because of sexual um activities with some of the teachers or whatever she did somebody reported and say she was um, inappropriate in touching the teachers and stuff so you know it's everywhere no matter where you you go you you find that you know well so it's boy back in the day back in the day we used to these things used to happen and these things were toler tolerated just because of it, without the technology those things was not being spread in terms of news and and, and advertise those things would have be under the rug so a lot a, a lot more of that was was happening and equally enough you find that sometimes years after the fact when when somebody is made an example of in terms of they get caught people come and say well yeah this same person did that to me how many years ago or, yeah but all in thing but all in things are happening right now to pdd because that, the, the, the that, them things, them things been been going on for for ages, you know, going on for yeah, but, but as but right now, now there is a lot, right of, now, a lot of social social medias, you know, so that is yeah. why now things start starting to you know get out and everything. No, but all that thing that happened to PDD right now is just because the 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 mayor of New York decided to open a one week um to give anybody that been 
abuse and everything to come in and and, and file it in. So that's that's mm-hmm. how all that thing come come along. You understand? All right. Mm-hmm. So, wow. It just yeah because normally after twenty years, you you cannot go and go back and file it. But yeah, yeah. Yeah. So they give that. <laughs> so well, let me you tell know. you, there's a lot of people in those lawsuits apart from PD, the name that's been mentioned. There's a lot of other people. I saw a thing of a, I saw of a thing, uh, an actual um, guy who claims to be a Christian rapper. And he is saying how, I should have gotten the clip to show it, but he was saying how he's been to the PDD parties and then he's seen certain stuff happen. Big up yourself, love gangster, big up yourself. Yes, I. So a, a lot of parties, um, and then when they tell him you don't want to be around here for midnight because, you know, that's when things get a little bit freaky. And he said, well, he was in the studio downstairs and when he left, went upstairs, when he looked, he see two people making out there. He was like, okay. Look there. When he go to another place, he realized the music changed. You see fellas there with fellas enjoying themselves and whatever. But, you know, I think lifestyle. Lifestyle is a big thing. I don't care if it's dance hall, hip hop or whatever. Yo, people, 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 they, people do it for the fifth million, the million is dance or now they're talking. No, because I wanna I wanna mention another artist as well. Let's look at um oh my god, Tory Lanes. Yeah? Yeah. You'll know of Tory Lanes, right? Tory Lanes is Yeah, 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 yeah. He's in prison right now. He's in prison right now. Um the kiss with Megan the Stallion, according to them allegedly, or well, it's not alleged anymore. He's behind bars for yeah. that. Now he's shorter. Yeah. But apparently, allegedly, he was seeing both her and her friend. And however, the thing played out, you know, drinks, alcohol, gun stuff happened. Now, again, his dad came forward and said that Jay Z, that's the one behind that, allegedly, because you know, the guy went independent and he was making more money as an independent artist um and he was encouraging artists to do this to do the same you see it's important really i think a lot of a lot of those artists that that um that understand the business they put themselves in a position to make money but a lot of artists they have habits and their, their personal preference in terms of if it's either drug abuse or violence or whatever, and they always find that before you know it, it's a downward spiral. You know, I would rather not make it than to reach that level of success and to end up behind bars, my brother. It's true. Yeah, Maxwell, Maxwell, Maxwell say people are being educated right now on and about the law. True. Yeah, it's true. True. It's we true. Always, we always know the law. Yeah. So, Buju, so, Buju, so. Buju, Buju is a total example. Look, while Buju was in prison, he went to do his, his masters and look at look it. Look it. Yeah. Well, again, when you're inside there, I guess they have nothing. They have nothing to do. Yeah. Yeah. Find something. Are you? Are you find Jesus? You find God? You find something? Or you? You know. Well, a, a lot of the times too, when you realize. Um, it's down to the legal system and, and your lawyer for your freedom. So you owe it to yourself mm-hmm. to educate yourself as well. You know, as yeah, you have to, yeah, you have to, you have to so with your time because all you have when you're behind bars is time, time to reflect, time to you know decide. And we take our freedom for granted. Whilst we here, yeah, that like we're free, we online, we're chilling, we're talking about them man and thing. You know what I mean? We have our freedom. And then the reality is there are people that are behind bars and they would do anything to go back into time, to, to, to reverse the hands of time. Um, and that's especially artists that, the young artists that idolize, you know, the violent aspect of music. You know, that is being glorified. And then that gang business. Well... But half of the artists that sing about half of the artists that sing about the, the guns and stuff back like back in the days they were never in gangs. You understand? Well, I'm talking about and, now. 
Now it's a but now now now, now it's a different thing. Now this is a different thing. They say you can't smile. Gang for true. <laughs> yeah, now now you can't even smile. You know, it become a gang vibe, and then that that it was that a, really long 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 ago. It, it was a, a clash clash vibe, like lyrics to lyrics on stage. But now he's a he's a gang vibe a gang vibe. But but it was it was still in that clash vibe. Guys used to go sing serious, you know, bro. Guys, they were yeah, we used to we we used to clash, clash back home in the, in the music, in the music. We used to clash in the music before, but when you check on Fridays and you go downtown by Pops, you'll find all the same musicians that used to clash. They're still having a drink. They're still talking. They're still, you know, chilling. You know? Boy, but let me tell you, it's just a thing where, boy, the, the generation now, influence, and again, technology, the things they have at their disposal, you know, um, it's just like they're masterminds, but the focus is not really on the music. Um, a lot of them, when you see they start getting that success and guys following them, those guys have nothing to lose. They'll do anything. Yeah, but look, you look know? an example again. Look an example. This week, I think uh, there was a, a young rapper that just that got killed in Toronto, and um, there's a rapper that just killed his his mom, his dad, and his brothers. That's you not know? a rapper. That's so a bad it's... man. Right that no, man, I'm just saying that because man just no. he's a rapper. You killing your parents? Well, you know, sometimes, sometimes mental mental yeah. issues. A lot of people go for mental health. You know. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. at the end, at the end of the day, we cannot, we cannot, I cannot diagnose anybody for anything. I'm just saying, a lot of us go for that mental health problem, but we never open up because we think we can, we can take it on by ourselves. It would and be we interesting put him... to go and listen to his music, Leo, to see what kind of vibes he was preaching. Nah, man. Next night, shoot people to know now. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, no. So once we're on the vibes cartel thing, um, let's just yeah. bring in our our um news because on this show it's not just like we say we don't just promote artists. We have our news segment. We have our don't laugh segment. So let me run our news intro, and then we go run a little. We'll take you to the streets of Jamaica. To see what the Jamaicans are saying or people are saying about Vibes Cartel. Take it away. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Caribbean Celebrity Show. Thanks for tuning in tonight and welcome. Tonight's presentation is sponsored by Bomb Drop Studio UK. And tonight we have interesting news for you. Stay tuned. Caribbean Celebrity News. Roll the clip, guys. <coughs> Cameron, that's the news. Well, so I see they have to free up the whole bus, you see? Free up at the Zotama. Yeah, man, the teacher. Yeah, man. I, I have a message for the, for the privity committee. We want them to free up the whole bus. Two times to come around. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Yeah. I, I see. I know that thing I say. The man innocent star. Check it out. Vibes can't tell. Them can't tell where I'm do it or I'm not do it. Vibes can't tell. And himself can't tell what really happened. Oh, no. See, it's a prophesized. Vibes can't tell. So you never can tell. It could go either way, you know. You could get free up. See, dumb is a must. If it's a pick-up meeting, you the man, Vibes Cartel. I want to tell that free up Vibes Cartel. Yeah, man. You didn't come around. Now, you see you. <laughs> you see on your new thing. I really like them thing, you know. Let me smoke my thing. <laughs> see? Free up the teacher. Free up the teacher. One love. Yep. Thank you so much. Well, there you have it. There you have it, folks. They say yesterday the man was, well, they say he's, he's innocent. I don't know if I would go as far as saying that, but according to his lawyer, he's innocent. Like they say, boy. <laughs> <I don't... laughs> Well, um, first, time, first time I ever see a big, a big spliff like that, you know. 
What? Now you know I played the wrong clip. The clip was supposed to play. Yeah, it was not effective. <laughs> it, it needed the sound effects. Let me run a little piece. I played the wrong one. Let me just see that. I see they have to free up the whole boss, you see? Free up a busy farmer. Yeah, man, the teacher. Yeah, man. I, I have a message for the for the privity committee. We want them to free up the whole boss. Two times to come around. <laughs> yeah, man, I mean. <laughs> Yeah. Had Maka, had Jamaican weed. <laughs> Boy, my youth came there when I was editing that, and I man say, Daddy, what do you have in his mouth there? I say, Papa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord, boy. Yeah, man. So, well, let's. So what, 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 what do you think? He, is he innocent or he's not innocent? Well, it's not for me to pass judgment, but what I believe, I believe there was efforts made to try to get a mistrial, calculated efforts in the beginning, that whole jury thing, and with some of the, well, the mishandling of the evidence by the police, these things have contributed, but the fact remain is somebody is responsible for the disappearance of Lizard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I happened to listen to the phone call recordings um, that was part of the evidence of his phone. And if you listen to that, some of it is very damning because he's asking the guy, and they refer to the guns as shoes. You say, like, you know, what you hear about the shoes or what you hear about the, the thing, and the guy, whoever's talking to him, say, like, you know, the police came around and they and they start searching and the thing. See, asking, what did they, what, what did he say? What happened? You hear my name mentioned? You know, he's asking these questions, you know? And then he's saying, like, yeah, something to the effect that, boy, they will never find that man, wherever he is, you know? So it's almost like admit, admitting, you know what I mean? If you, it could be maybe my interpretation of what I heard was wrong. Allegedly, what I've heard is somebody, <sighs> Asking certain questions to see if they're implicate, implicated in, in, or at least if they're a suspect. So, yeah, yeah. going to show you certain conversations. And also, and also, the, also, the his, his, his house, they said, like, when the police came, came, like, when the police went to his house, like, it was smelling like disinfectant, you know? And then after they, 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 they mash up the house. Mm -hmm. They match up the house, and then another time again, they burn the house. The house so yeah. no evidence. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, and all of that as well. For what? Apparently, like they say, for the shoes, for two shoes. So the man is saying, like, the guy started. The guy came around them, and nobody. He's asking, like, where you know that guy from? Nobody already know him. The guy, the, those, the and then the, the shoes disappear. What well, I'm saying, shoes instead of the pew pew. So he yeah, said, like, yeah, yeah. he went back his pew pew because he leave them in charge of his pew pew. And yeah, you see that guy uses town man mentality. Come around them, play like you know, and then he, he well, it was a, it was a, um a, an illegal illegal yeah illegal yeah. shoes. Yeah, illegal shoes. <laughs> yeah. So, so, I mean, you have all that, you have all that money and all that thing. You could count your losses, man. So, is it really worth? You know what I mean? But it's just again the mentality. That mentality. Mentality, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, respect, yeah. You yeah. know the respect that the man, and again moving around with certain elements, certain elements. The, you know the gangster, the bad boy elements moving around with them, those people. You will find you will find yourself in some sort of um trouble, you know. We say Gasa, what the man King Iran. Well, I guess it's the Rasta Jumba. They was laughing at their boy. Yeah, man. So uh, you know it's a it's a it's an interesting thing, man. We have to just hope that when we have amazing artists and talent that they know better than to fall victim to you know them kind of them kind of um 
violence, gun violence, you know. Yeah. Now, we want to take a little message from, you know, one of our celebrity friends. As you know, the show is called Caribbean Celebrity. Let's take a little message from, let's see if you know the celebrity. This is Snoop to the D to the O to the G, endorsing this one for Cash Major and Mr. X on the Caribbean Celebrity Show. This is Snoop. To yeah, big up yourself, Snoop. You don't know, big up yourself, the Godfather, D O double G. You check it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we do not think, you know, we do not think, we do not think. The same way it was, it was the same way Snoop, Snoop was almost in that same situation, too, you know, for a murder case, and then he couldn't, he couldn't travel to, to, to the UK. Yeah. And then I think he, he got, he got permission from the Queen. Wow. Yeah, yeah, from the cool. You can you, you can Google it. Well, yeah. I won't say nothing bad about Snoop because Snoop gave us a big up there. You check it. Yeah. So I won't I say nothing bad about Snoop. Big up Snoop. <laughs> 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 I won't say nothing yeah. bad about Snoop. But you but again too, you must have proper ranks eh, for the queen to to uh, as 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 big ranks, bro. Yeah, 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 man. Yeah, man. Big ranks, big yeah, ranks, man. big ranks. Yeah. Man. Mm -hmm. So in 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 in, in vibes scatter case, they have a lot, a lot going on. They have a lot, a lot, a lot going on. Yeah, there's a more to it on. than the eye, and then I. But I think he'll walk free. To be honest, my conviction is that is the first step towards his freedom. I don't know when he will, he will, um, you know, he will walk free. But I think in next ten, in next ten years they'll drag that. You think so? Yeah, they'll drag that man. Nah, man, the world is watching Jamaica. You know, the whole world is watching. You know, everybody watching. Because you, you remember what the what the what the reporter said there. That begs the question to determine if Jamaica can handle high profile murder trials. You understand? So yeah. that 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 scrutiny that they are under there right now. Believe you me. The powers that are be are definitely trying to determine what is the next move and how mm -hmm. to save face. How to save face, you know. In other words, how to come out of it and not make themselves look any more tainted than yeah. they already are. You know. Yeah. So you you so think you think they, they can they can mount a, a lawsuit against the the, the system for yes, keeping them being back? Yes, but the guys say that the guys say that that, that that there's a possibility that they will do so, and and they stand okay, to okay. if they release. But then again, to be mm -hmm. honest, to be honest, so and that, that is why and look, look all all that too. The system will try will drag it, you know, because they know that they know that gonna come. They yes, know that unless, for example. They work out some plea bargain or some deal and say, well, boy, we will let you out. Um, and let we just leave it at let, let's leave it as that. As you know, as as a loss. Let's just leave it at yeah. that. And then, you know, sign some agreement. We release, we release you all, but that is it. No further legal thing on either part on either party's side. So, you know, yeah. maybe, maybe that could be that could be something to 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 to, to look out for. Um, I don't know the, how it's going to play out. If they have to do a, 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 a retrial, all, all the evidence, like, to be, it, it, it ain't making any sense anymore, you know? Yeah, and, 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 yeah, yeah. And, yeah. And, and some of the main evidence that the prosecution brought forward, the 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 Privy Council said that that, that now they can't use that evidence if, they, if they're going because, forward. Yeah, exactly. You know? It's a mad thing. Exactly. Man. Really mad thing. Really, really, really crazy thing, man. Boy, let me tell you, boy, that made me appreciate my freedom more because, like, you know, don't mind that everybody saying, boy, free vibes cartel, free vibes cartel. <laughs> you know, everybody, everybody saying free vibes cartel, but boy, let me tell you, you have to look at the other side of the coin. What about the, the victim, his family? Sometimes, Vibes cartel might be safer in the, in there than if than out, you know. You understand? Because there are cases where people have been accused of um it's the same murder and they've done their time and come out and then they just did themselves. They went back in. You know. Big up yourself, fire youth. Big up yourself. So we want to go to this segment called Don't Laugh. 
So we have some clips. I really want to get your opinion on that. Let me run the intro, man. Yes, folks. Caribbean Celebrity Show. Let me see if I could cue that clip. <laughs> and now for the segment we call Don't Laugh. Seriously, don't laugh. <laughs> Yo, look at her. You can't get a number. Woman, all of me are on Put a number in this field. Put! You're saying nobody want the number. Bad man! Oh, good! Oh, good, yeah. We are wrong, come on, you know, so put a bit of love on my life. Look, man! Hold on! I can't that! Jesus Christ! Hold on! 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 Hold <laughs> Let's take it another one. I want to check out another one. Let's take it another one. Make a sentence for the word deceitful. You ask him to make a sentence for the word deceitful. Are you not crazy, boy? Somebody enter the maxi and the driver say, All deceitful. <laughs> 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 no, that you bad. That you bad boy. Make a sentence with the word deceitful. The driver say somebody enter the bus, the maxi, and only deceitful. Bring them. BS, BS, and, and drum and, 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 and thing, man. Jesus love me, say, she said, no, me say, from me head, me say, from me toe, me say, Jesus love me, say, she said, no, me say, from me head, me say, from me toe, me say. All right, come, come, go on, go on. One more, one more. All right, Emma, Emma, come, Emma, come, man. Hey, hey, come. JJ, go on with it. Jesus love me, say, Jesus no, me say, from me head, me say, from me toe, me say, Jesus love me, say, Jesus love. All right, yeah, Jesus love me. 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 Jesus love why do you laugh? Why? Why the things you see, boy? My God. Yeah. Oh, Lord of mercy. Mm -hmm. I think I go get one more. Yeah, yeah. Oh, full time in the brother. <laughs> nice little kitty. Oh, that was that was uh, that was uh, missing. That was not a joker. That was serious, serious, serious. Do laugh, Missy. Boy, what's your favorite Chinese food? Let me just ask you all before I go to the clip, to the clip. What's your favorite, uh, Leo? What's your favorite uh, Chinese? I don't really eat Chinese, you know. After that, I suspect you're going Chinese at all. Let oh, full time in a brother. <laughs> nice little kitty. Wait, I want to make a pussy cat there. No, sir. Hold on. Two last clock. The man, I make a pussy for dinner. Boy. Boy. Gasa the man, Gasa boy, that the man cook the cat and the man put all kind of sauce and thing on that hey boy, 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 boy. Yeah, you'll eat that, you won't even know, you know. Boy, so you can see, you know. You go eat that there, boy, and the way that man, 
You see, that's the thing when you go in them fancy restaurant, boy. You don't know what you eating, boy. When they give you thing a fancy name. Meow, meow, meow. <laughs> <laughs> well, I I I I turn I turn vegetarian, so <laughs> oh, oh, no. not eat at all. Well, I eat I eat um chicken once a month. I just, oh, I'm it. just not much, just a, a little, a little chicken, not. You, you're a terian, you're not a vegetarian. <laughs> yeah, terian, a terian, yeah. <laughs> hey, you know, let me stay back home. You have, to, you have to eat chicken. I don't eat meat. You have to eat a little chicken because, yeah. <laughs> you know, if you get a chip, chicken, you know, you do a chicken, uh, chicken yeah. not meat. Yeah, chicken not meat. Chicken not meat? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, yeah, I, I, I said not, 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 not all the time, but like maybe once yeah, a month I eat a yeah, chicken. Yeah. Yo, 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 you guys, yeah, you, you have to, your, Major, your body you have to save that little clip. You have to save that little clip. Save that little clip. Chicken, yeah, the chicken tap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Man. Yeah. That's the thing. Okay, but like for example, have you ever heard of mountain chicken? Of course, yeah. Well, we, 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 I don't. I, I, I remember that a long time ago. You know, I went to perform in, in Dominica, and I asked for that, and then I, 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 they give me a piece of it to, to taste. Yeah, it wasn't. I do find it was all that. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Listen, um, when I was in, when I, when I was in, one of the cruise ships I was the on, where, the place where we bought it from. Yeah, it wasn't even even the um the person did a, a fish tea, a fish meal, and it wasn't that maybe the diff different person they, they cook it, you know, different style oh, of cooking and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's the same way if you if you go to somebody's Saint Lucia and you ask for the national dish, people prepare it different ways, you know. Different ways. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It might get some. It might get some banana with um just oil. Right. So. Yeah, man. But um. <laughs> Bro, I want to oh, take it some, when, when, when I come by, you will have to do that, you know, a, 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 a green pig and saltfish. Yeah, man. Oh, boy. I don't know. Ooh, I don't know when last I had that, bro. I really want to. Yeah, hear we'll that. do a green pig and saltfish, man. I will, I will, I will, I will do that for you, man. Ask chef. So, we want to take in. Man, we have a few more minutes. So, let's take in another. Do laugh. Uh, put a short one, you know. So. Let's see what this one is about, boy. I think that one is a partner pick that... Pick up, um, up yourself, Leroy. That's a partner that, um, you know, go to church for the first time. You know, sometimes you meet a you meet a girl and then, boy, they make you convert to whatever religion. So, yeah. you know, you know about when you have, when you take the Lord's tea or um, communion, you know, you have to take a little thing and give it back and share it. But my boy, check that one out, boy. Uh, what's happening? It's not running. No, we don't even have to go lethal. Boy, where is your father say that when you do greedy fuck you? <laughs> Man, dong that. You know, <laughs> you man, you man check himself in check there. <laughs> you know, some some as as I as I say that I saw a video clip about Father Albert saying people that come and take lost tea, they're doing stuff with the lost tea, you know. Yeah, I saw that too. I saw him say that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you I, see I didn't I, I I didn't I didn't know that, huh? It's not necessarily them, you know, it's whoever they go to the guard there that telling them so they come in they come in, in church. Yeah, the priest giving them the lost tea in their hand, and they go in the fit and they bring it to whoever to do whatever they want for them. You, you, you're talking about the holy communion, the holy communion, yeah. Well, they call it body of Christ, isn't it? The Lord see the yeah, holy communion. That's what they say. But you know, yeah. when you say lost tea, when you say lost tea, it's just like you lost a tea, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, I understand, I understand, I understand. I heard that before, but but it's it's like you know, hmm. speculations and stuff. So you're not there when they're doing this stuff. So, no. Let me see that one. So, have you? Oh, okay. Go ahead. The you saying there. That one go kill you all. <laughs> let, let me ask you another question. Some you you think 
Vibes Cartel is in the Illuminati? Boy, that is a deep, that is a deep thing. I don't think I'll make glasses for that. I think in the entertainment fraternity, there are different organizations based on where you at, the level you at. Um, you will have access to certain other people. So it's like. I will not put a, um, a class over it and say it's Illuminati or this or that. But when you enjoy a certain level of success, certain doors will open up to you. And obviously, you will join certain organizations as the elites yeah. can do. So I think he is... He is or was a member of some special group or elite and i think mm. as often the rumor has it you have to play ball otherwise they pull the handbrakes on you because i've seen yeah i've seen it in yeah. certain music videos of his certain things that makes me aware and he's so a, he, he didn't he didn't he didn't he didn't he didn't he didn't play the ball so that's why they have him like that what i will say to as well when they have this sort of um alliance they tend to think that they're invincible they think they are they're above the law because of everybody everybody because of for example let's just say the three of us yeah we have separate businesses, but we link up. Let's say you are a high court judge. You, police commissioner, or maybe customs excise, some high job, you know? And we link up. You know, boy, you in a little jam there, boy. You call your partner, boy, look out for me. So those sort of things happen, and that is why certain alliances are formed. And in fact, even maybe whoever his business associates will be for um, managing him or whatever would have have certain things in place for him, you know? But as anything else, I think Illuminati or whatever Nati, you are, you, are <laughs> good, you are good as to what you could do for them and how much they could control you. And Vibes can tell you somebody that is very defiant at one time, you know? Yeah, so even, even to the government and you have to watch too look at it when you look at Bob Marley if you look at the conspiracies as to why um, he was allegedly gotten rid of because there's a guy who came out on his deathbed that said he was the one responsible for Bob Marley's demise oh, yeah, yeah. I, I, I heard about that heard about because that. yeah in Bob, Bob Marley case they, they knew he, he had Quicksilver and when you have Quicksilver, anything that that prick you, you're in trouble. Right. So that is why they put the thing for him in, in his shoes and he got... Right. Um, so, yeah. again, that is why he was taken out. Because he was so powerful. Vibes can tell yeah. he could have been as influential or even more influential than Bob Marley was to Jamaica. Bob Marley was influential to the world when he was in his peak. Everybody was following him and his message. Now, Jamaica... The entire youth was following this guy. The police, the government didn't have control over me. I believe. <coughs> so sorry. When people get to that level, they be you they be perceived as a threat. If I can't talk to you, I can't tell you, boy. You know, so whatever he was a member of, it couldn't save him. And maybe contributed to making sure that you know he's either behind bars or that will determine if he gets set free. So we'll have to wait and see. But um, to be honest, I don't know if he's Illuminati, but I think he, yeah, he's in some sort of brotherhood. He, some he brotherhood, had, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Had, yeah because that, yeah. I, I was watching some 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 videos about him, and then some students was asking him some questions, and that question came came up, and then they asked him about the tattoo, the the Illuminati sign on his chest. <laughs> You know, but you don't want to give a, a straightforward answer. 
you know, and then he said like the 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 what I've written on the East Chest is in God we trust. Yeah, but that's on the money. Yeah, the, the dollar bill. Yeah, you it's know. Nothing. Yeah, but he but he mentioned the the he mentioned the big celebrities that's in the Illuminati, but he didn't involve himself he as said. well. Like he keep himself. Yeah. He's an educated guy. He's intelligent. He's, he's, really, he's, very, he's very intelligent. He's very yeah. intelligent. And you can imagine now, if he is spending his time inside there reading, can you imagine? Yeah. Although Jamaican prison is not like, from what I've been told, not like in the States where, you know, you have the luxury of like, you know, libraries and all them kind of things. And, you know, that is, I do imagine it's the same. So he would have to really go out of his way to probably get access to stuff. But he was yeah. recording so you know boy he will forever be something somebody that's relevant i think even after he you know after his time on earth people will always refer to him there's always there's always some great man michael jackson bob marley you know there's always some some artists that have impact in a massive way but they've reached a, like a early a early demise you know they've made the demise and they've not enjoyed their full longevity of their life, you know? So, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, is it worth it? That's the question. Is it worth it? Is it... That's why, according to the biblical aspect, what does it profit a man if he gains the whole world and suffer the loss of his soul? Yeah. So, um, any organization that we don't understand or kind of, you know, above, as they would say, our pay grade, our understanding, it's easy to speculate. And think well, you know. Yeah, think the worst. But these things have their benefits, and it benefits certain people. But as anything, as I learn in life, nothing is free. Eh? No, nothing yeah, is yeah, free. Yeah, 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 it's true. So yeah, nothing is make, free. We all make sacrifices in life for what we think we want or what we think we need. Nothing is yeah, free. So, nothing is free. Yeah, yeah no. For, I, I I give you one. I give you one example. I give you one example. Look at the the, the earthquake that happened in, in 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 Haiti, and then certain artists, big celebrities from the U.S. consider they going to help because they help them as well. Hmm. Yeah, they're going to help Haiti because they help them as well. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Yeah. Well, but... I know what I know what you mean by that, but okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Even, even, even certain artists as well uh, in, 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 in in Jamaica, and then they wasn't paying their debt, and then the 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 person that doing the fight for them, the daughter speak out. Wait, wait, wait! Let's get it on the ground news, boy. Huh? <laughs> I say, wait! Let's get it on the ground news. <laughs> yeah. Boy, yeah. there's a lot of information out there, you know. It's not like yeah, before. there is a lot. Yeah, there is a lot. There is a lot. There is yeah, a lot. Yeah, but you know, it's not like before. Before we were, we were, we were knowing things after years after. Now it's seconds after. It's out there, you know. But as you say, Haiti, let's take in one more clip. You know me as a kicks off already. Let's take in one clip. Haitian guy <laughs> in America, still have his Haitian accent, but let me listen to him. Yeah. How do you call this? Let me get six piece nugget. Hey, let me get with the nuggets. I want the bl uh, the black people sauce. Excuse me. I want the six piece nugget. A uh, black people sauce. What is the black people sauce? Black people sauce is the sauce the black people uh, love to eat anything with. Barbecue sauce. Yes, yes, that's the black people sauce. Barbecue. Okay. I don't want no ketchup. No ketchup is for white people. No Spanish that, people. That. Dad, I want a Hershey pie. Stop it. Hershey pie. Get man. No pie. Get man. No pie. Get man. No pie. Get man. No pie. Get man. Get man. No pie. Get man. Get man. No Get man. No Get man. No pie. Get man. No pie. Get Excuse me? I want the six piece nugget. A uh, black people sauce. What is the black people sauce? Black people sauce. Is the sauce the black people uh, love to eat anything with? Barbecue sauce? Yes, yes. That's the black people sauce. Barbecue. Okay. 
I don't want no ketchup. No ketchup is for white people. It's no Spanish people. Dad, I want a Hershey pie. Stop it. Hershey pie. Don't get man. No valet pie can get up and put this on machine and put my pie for my Huh? I don't want to wait and say you want Hershey pie. I'm going to pie cut here. I'm sorry. This is the stupid boy in the back. He want pie. I'm sorry, baby. Hey, yes. So just one six piece of barbecue sauce? Yes, one six piece get a uh, black people sauce <laughs> uh, and, a, and a food punch. Small, medium, or large? Uh, wow. How much? How much the large? Large is like 320. Mm, no sure, you kill me. <laughs> give, give, me the, give me the pity one, the pity one. The, excuse me? Uh, the small, small. Small? Yes. That, that can be shorter? Uh, yes, what's the total? Huh? He means what's his total? Oh, uh, what is the total? You want to say that I don't 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 want to say that I speak the English Yes, baby, what's the total? He means the total The total <laughs> <laughs> boy, nobody oh Asian at me, Z boy. Oh my goodness, man. Boy, Caribbean people are the best, you know. We the best. Yeah. Uh the best. We adopt the man have the the man still have his Asian accent. I'm still young man. <laughs> <laughs> boy, rap me and he said um um, I'm going to make you this and <laughs> Oh boy, my goodness. Believe it or not, that's our family, eh, bro. We all came from Africa together. <laughs> that could be us. We could have our grandparents, great grandparents could have landed in Haiti. That could have been us. <laughs> Oh, well, well, guys, it's been a lovely show, man. Any, any, any last words there before we wrap it up, uh, Mister? Well, I just, I just hope, I just hope the free vibes cartel. You know, yeah, going to come out to make some, some, some good music, good dancehall. Well, the, well, the man, man, the, 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 the kind of dancehall I'm hearing now, I don't even understand. I cannot even understand that. Well, it's just, it's, it's, just, it's just the system evolving, eh? you know, even some of the, yeah. the rap music, you don't understand anything, but, you know, the younger generation and, and enjoy it, you know, it's evolving, Mumble you rap. know, yeah, you know, so. Um, but, but, um, boy, the man, I heard he's married now. Yeah, he's married to yeah, a girl from the UK. Married. Girl from the, the English, UK. English woman. Yeah. yeah. Most of them usually find Christianity in jail, so he must be praying. Night and day for his release. Yeah, and Jack so, is still inside there. Jack Yo inside is still inside. I I, I also heard he, he he turned Christian. I don't know how true it is. But beyond that, yeah, man, it's been a lovely show, a lovely vibe. You know, um, tune in again with us next week. We're gonna have more entertaining videos. Caribbean celebrity vibes. You never know who will have in the house. Mix with Party Jams Radio. Oh, sorry. My favorite part of the station has to be the DJ. Ottawa's oh. number one DJ station. Also, we broadcasting live on uh, Party Jams Radio in Canada. So definitely, you could keep rocking with Party Jam and listen to the DJs and the music we have there all week, in fact. But just today, you could tune into PartyJamsRadio.com. And uh, look out again this coming Sunday. It's going to be hot. Mr. X, I think you have some nice funny videos you normally pass to me. We'll start having to put some of your videos as well. Yeah, yeah. man, yeah, man. Good little clips. Keep it interesting. We have some uh, breaking news we'll be bringing you again. And don't forget, this is the one and only Caribbean celebrity show where we bring the celebrities to your fingertips. Have a blessed week. Guys, it's been a pleasure. I laugh so much I start choking. So <laughs> <laughs> don't forget. Next week is a hot show. We promise to bring you entertainment, laughter, music, news, and what again? And what again?
What are you giving me sex? What are you giving them next week? Next week? Mm-hmm. Well, I, I don't know yet, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, if you all want to be in the program, just message us. Okay? Just message us at any time. And we'll bring you on the, uh, you know, we'll bring you on the... Okay, let me run the... I think that's the video. I do apologize if it's the wrong one. Um, but yeah, look out for artists like Mr. X, Crazy K, um, yours truly, I'm on that. We have um, 11, we have um, Studio 911, Jahim Japima. Um, we also have an Antiguan artist, I believe, as well. Uh, we artist have from Tanzania. Artist from Tanzania. And then we have artists from Switzerland. Switzerland as well. Yeah, so it's William here, William Martin Sugar Daddy, Sugar Daddy. So yeah, man, it's a good look. So we want that one. We want when we drop it, we want something epic. They have to be like a proper online party. The artists. We also there. we also have Mark, Mark Eleven, right? Mark Eleven is on it as well. There are some top tunes. Um, Must Bus is on it as well. Must Bus have a bad tune, bad tune. Yeah, yeah, man. At least maybe ten or eleven artists. So um, you know, it's gonna be a wicked, 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 wicked vibe. Artist segment rhythm. Look out for it. The date to be announced later, but we start in the every week leading up, we'll start giving you a little more information and, and um updates on it. So again, it's been a blessing, it's been a good vibe. Let me just give you all a little piece of it. We don't want no fake y'all. No plastic materials. Pick up on the natural yeah. No silicone. 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 No <laughs> folks, bless up, it's been a pleasure. Big up yourself, Leo. Big up yourself, Mr. X. Thanks for joining us, folks. We'll catch you guys again. Yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, man. And don't forget, as we go off here, you could just follow the vibe straight on Party Jams Radio. Yeah, man. Bless up. One love. <laughs>